our magnum frame and some sub six twos. Okay. Whoa. What is up everybody, it is Melbro here, I'm back with the Challenge Master episode 23. In the video today we are going to... Challenge is going to be raid 5 safes, and uh, for a reward of the sniper rifle stock, and the f potential of failure is no armor next episode, which will be brutal if I fail this. I don't think I'll have too much issues, but while well, overnight I did actually wind up uh, running over to Shotgun Messiah, I figured I, since I already cleared out the place, I should at least uh, run over and just uh, grab some stuff. And I did manage to upgrade uh, stock on my submachine gun to give my uh, give myself uh, higher quality levels. And uh, managed to build an extra hunting rifle and got half a half an SMG, full shotgun, a couple extra handgun parts, you know, just some various stuff scattered about in the in this. It's like uh, so pretty nice uh, to do. But let's just kind of. I think there's a prison around here for uh, for uh the loot, which I can take care of, and, uh, it looks like we got a couple shanty towns if there's not a prison, so let's actually just take a look around here. Did have a campfire running. Okay, yes, there is a prison. But, yo, know, since there is, like, a since we kind of raided a prison in the first town, like, uh, yeah, I figured let's just start off with, uh, the shanty town. Uh, actually, these are trailer parks, which these do have safes as well. So it's like we got some variety for loot. Uh, this is the shanty town. Getting a little cold again. Yeah, not too, not too worried about it. It's if anything, I'll warm up by a campfire, car battery. There's the funeral home. Well, let's just see. Yeah, Amicon funeral home is there, and then I know I could just take the mini bike, uh, potential gas barrel on the way back. Oh, I thought that was a shanty town. Oh, there it is. So let's actually just pick this uh, gas barrel up. Well, as, uh, at the moment, gas is kind of a precious commodity. And we got, yeah, we got the company here. Got Mikey and uh, Jack here. Good morning, Jack. Come here, buddy. Ow. No, please don't, don't smack me. I know I'm running low on durability with my, uh... My club. Come here. Probably gonna give out on me any second now. Come on, Jack. And... Come on, big boy. Basically doing Jack squat with us now. Um... Oh! What a little scenario, uh... Probably about to break the. Yep, we're broken. You know what, Jack? You've earned yourself a 762. Just come here, big boy. Come on. Oh, I think that was Mikey. I'm deciding to give me a love tap. There you go, huh, Jack. 
Mikey, I don't have uh, time to deal with you at the moment. I don't have any uh, iron to make a re iron reinforced club. Um, we'll just scrap you down. We'll actually be able to just get iron from the from that club itself. Basically, it'll be reincarnated as a iron reinforced club. Marvelous. Just gonna chop some wood real quick. Fabulous. Where are those seeds? Uh, oh, blue from blue spruce. Uh, just wanna gather a couple uh, wood frames and get the uh, new iron reinforced club ready. I would beat through this uh, door, but it's actually a better idea just to just to climb over the side and have a with some wood frames makes it a lot easier on me. But I wanted to raid this uh, though because there is a gun safe in here. Hunting rifle stock. Morning Annie. I apologize for lack of light, you know, while fighting zombies in here. I'd have to go all the way back home and I am planning on going back after doing some more raiding in this town today, so... Now, I gotta be careful here because I want to, yes, there it is, um, because I don't want to get blown up. There we go. Um, should that... Are you serious? Hopefully I don't get blown up. Let's just actually chop a block out. I am really cheesing this, uh... A little bit here. Um... Damn it, I think I missed. Explosion's loud, but we should be fine now. <laughs> Just break into the gun safe. Uh, as long as I don't be stupid and run through the uh, hit that landmine. Just uh, be in here. Looks like pistol uh, parts. Yes, very nice. I think we might be able to have. Uh, a whole pistol. Hello, who's in here? That is one safe here rated though, at least, so... Got one of the five. Let's see, um... Ooh, nice, uh, shopping basket that I can use. Read the coolers. Got some beer and water in jars. The huge. Uh, oh. Hi, Marla. How you doing? Just crawl around, I see. Come here. There you go, sweetie. And we got, it looks to be... Oh yeah, Mike and Mikey. Sorry, buddy. Just slow being able to, uh... I just love being able to reach right through there and just smack them around a little bit. What she got, Marla? Oh, not much. I think these are shamway boxes, so let's just put that torch there. At least have a little bit of light and just read these cupboards. And let's see. Yes, yeah, shamway. Extra beer and water. Won't have to worry about drinks for a little bit. Yeah, you can keep the, the rotting flesh there, bud. And not, there's not much in here, but... Let's see what's in the old driving basket. Nothing in there? Yeah, not the most, but... There's shopping basket, level 370. If I brought one of my workbenches here, I would have, uh... 
I'd be able to just start merging stuff together and condense space, but you live and you learn. Break into the little pharmacy here. Take my withdrawal out of the uh, register. Glass jars. Um... Oh, there we are. Pill cases. Six point science. And not really much in these. It's like so. See if I can get me an extra a bit of health. There we go. Wellness has increased, and I had to break into this one real quick. Oh voila! Nothing in here. Not too much to see, but these uh, shanty towns are at least pretty cool to uh, uh, see in the world, you know, like as uh, decorations. I do uh, want to let you know, though, if you made it this far into the video and you like what you see, uh, please uh, subscribe down below uh, if you haven't already. It helps the channel out a lot and, and uh, gives me a lot of support. And those of you that might be watching, uh, you know, that are already subscribed and are familiar with the channel, uh, I do want to give you an update, you know, so you're aware. The video after this, uh, which is, this video is going to be going up at midnight on Sunday, Central Standard Time, I put up a... I put up a, uh, a poll for people to vote on where and I, you know, I should start uploading uh, the the you know, just raw footage of the episodes, like uh, just uncut stuff. And uh, you know, although it only got four votes on it, and which uh, not too many votes, but it's enough for me, you know, like, I gave you guys a couple days to decide whether or not, you know, you want to, uh, you want it to happen. It's a three to one vote, so I'm gonna start uploading, um, the, the uncut versions of episodes an hour uh, after the uh, regular edited episodes, which are, like, 20 to 30 minutes. And that is not all, though. Um, I will be introducing a channel mascot with the... I will be introducing a channel mascot, you know, to uh, go with. Like, you know, I feel it's uh, kind of high time to, do, to start doing that. And you know, kind of have a sense, you know, at least you know, like uh, a fun little face with the channel and... I think y'all are gonna really like him. He he goes uh, he goes uh, a fair ways back with me. Uh, very personal little little buddy. Like uh, especially if you if uh, any of you watching or you know, like uh, seen me on Discord below. Like especially the server I would talk mostly, and you will know who he is. Uh, but uh, I'm excited to introduce him to you, and he will be coming with that. With the regular, with the regular upload on a uh, on YouTube, and and he will be doing that. It's like, but the the uncut footage will just be left uh, mostly unedited. Uh, the only times I will edit it will be uh, no, will be if I have to uh, speed it up uh, to keep it under an hour in length. The, the reason for that is I edit these videos on a share factory. And, uh... And... So it's like, uh... Doing this on PS5, I have to... Keep it under an hour in project length, so... Sometimes there might be some, uh, speeding up of the videos, uh... But you will get... You know, those of you interested who will get to watch the, uh... The regular uploads, so well, the the edited uploads and everything like that. So yeah, I just wanted to give you guys a couple updates, and uh, I'm going to just drop off the stuff in the house here.
and I will let you know once I start breaking into the prison. And I'm breaking into the prison now. I put some put most of the stuff from the shanty town away. We're just gonna leave this uh, area here alone for the uh, for the time being, just to because uh, I want to get to the to the big loot and everything. So I just want to get broken into here here, and I potentially don't want to get cold. So uh, if I remember correctly, good way to get in here is just breaking through these uh, fences. Okay, break the grass right away. And we'll just toss you out, and then break in there. Oh, a little bit dark in here, but got the old torch on standby. I uh, won't break in there, but let's break into here. Just give me a second here while I put you in the dark a little bit. Boom, boom. All right. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to break into these three safes. I want to remember I break into that one, especially because of last time I forgot to loot it. So just give me a second and we'll take a look at the main loot here. And I broke it into all the safes and didn't take too long, actually. So desk, you don't got much. Gun store box, what you got? Ooh, AK-47 stock, uh, AK stock and... Pistol barrel and shotgun stock, uh, so we have a complete pistol gun, a nice shotgun barrel and some paper, along with point gunsmithing. Receiver and, and stock for the shotgun and hunting rifle receiver, not too bad. And uh, the, the hunting rifle schematic and the uh, leather working schematic, uh, leather leg armor schematic. I said leather working because it just gives you the point. Question is, do I want to break into these, uh, break into these, uh, prison cells? I know, uh, not, wouldn't be too hard to break through, and, because they're only 2,500 hit points, and a couple Charlie, a couple dead Charlies in here, which they can potentially provide me with 40, I think I need 44 Magnum parts, so... And I would like to have a 44 Magnum built up so I can have the, uh, so I can start using the ammo. So, just give me a couple minutes here and I will break into them. And I've made it into all the cells, literally all of them. Uh, let's just pick up the torch here so I have the lighting. One second. And, you know, I figured let's just heck, get all the turds out too, you know, just... Just go for it, and uh, uh, I would like to have some fertilizer for the farm at home, and... Ooh! Wow! A 44 Magnum Cylinder. That is damn near perfect on... a quality. More turds and water. Uh, just break through this real quick. I probably could have done this off camera, but... Oh, well, no biggie. Still bust through it really quickly, so... Some iron and some coffee beans. Uh, we'll just throw those out and find those enough as is. More murky water, and let's just run upstairs. And I'm hoping one of these guys will have 44 magnum parts. It's like Dark Rock. I love having a cylinder, but nothing in you. You could at least give me the 44 magnum parts. They could be literally level one, and I wouldn't care whatsoever. Nothing in that toilet. You don't got anything in you. My steel pickaxe is almost broken. Nothing out of you. And we still got a few more we can we can uh, raid in the uh, raid throughout the prison. I know there's a couple more hanging out. Um, mostly water, but that uh, but that cylinder is really good for the magnums, so break out of here real quick and just gonna break through this. Forgot about this door. And 
Yeah, you can see like I'm not doing nearly as much damage as I would be doing at full durability, so. Pop through this. Get out the old uh, torture rooney. Got a corpse with nothing in it. Come on, Charlie. You, you can give me something other than the mag of the cylinder. Okay. What do you got for me, buddy? Our magnum frame and some 762s. Okay. Whoa! Accidentally had some uh, haulage on there. I, I that didn't happen at the last uh, at the last uh, POI at the last prison POI I raided, but wow, <laughs> I probably would have had a sprained leg after that one. <laughs> good, good thing I uh, was I just kept on running. Let's just break through here. Bam. Yeah, once I get back home, I'm definitely repairing this pickaxe so with a piece of steel or two, and then I'm going to uh, just start combining steel pickaxes that get better levels and uh, get more damage out of them. Same with steel fire axes. Eh, nothing up here. Run around. <laughs> just test the structural integrity again of the of the prison, uh, of, the, of the guard tower. That is a weird little anomaly. Uh, um, we can just go through here for this uh, one. Our magnum frame. All the magnum pieces in the world, uh, except for the the actual parts. What do you got? Not of course you don't. We'll just uh, sneak through here. Gotta do that structural integrity test. Uh, well, before I raid that save, which will be the last one I need to do for the mission, which is no biggie. Uh, let's see. I need to get through here. We can just run through this courtyard and then break through here, and I know a little roundabout way, but more grass to break with the pickaxe. Oops, my bad. Let's flex right through here. Be the last guard tower we have to, oh, we should raid, uh, oh, it's getting later in the day. Is there a dead Charlie up here that wants to talk to me? Yes, thank you, Charlie. You gave me 44 Magnum parts. Um, just to be absolutely sure, let's just, uh... Oh, it's unlocked. Yo, I want to check just to see if there's anything up here. Unfortunately, I don't think I can take the, uh... Those spotlights. Although that one's working. Be nice to have. But yeah, just give me a second I'll go raid the, uh... Raid that dust uh, safe in there and and uh, see what kind of loot. One more hit and let's see what we got. Another point for the you know, for gunsmithing. Let's actually check the points I got here. Um, weapon, firearms actually. Shotgun shell hook crafting, and we just need a couple more points out of the. Uh, we can start making 762s. So now, once I get home, uh, which I'm gonna be doing that after today's episode, uh, I'm gonna finally be able to uh, gonna be able to start making a good supply of shotgun stuff. So, um, doo -doo 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 -doo. I just wanna condense some of this stuff down for uh, for shotties. Uh, yeah, well, I finally have a complete magnum, and I did find in the, uh, the desk, uh, in that room, uh, the nice leather duster. So, very nice, uh, a bit of loot. The only other thing I've wanted to do today, actually, is 
just hit up this, uh, hit this working stuff tools, uh, help me get some extra iron, because, uh, I think I still need to finish off the iron bars over at, uh, at home. Check out the old shopping cart here. Or a jar and a can. Um, let's take care of old Jack. Come here, buddy. Come here. I know I could, uh, raid the, uh... Raid the big old, uh... Uh... I could have raided the, uh, well bunker there, but... Seeing enough of those, it's like nothing... Not the well bunker, I mean the, uh... The bunker shack. The, uh, we see enough of those, like, you know, where it's kind of like, uh, kind of same old, same old loot. Well, same old, same old. Ooh, there you go, nice little head explosion. And a couple pieces of clothing. Let's actually, uh, I'll actually wear those and scrap that down. Ooh, it's gonna be dark in here. Thing cabinet, just some brass. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna break into all these uh, crates because it's dark in here and I don't want to, you know, give you guys a lot of darkness. Uh, so I at least check the file cabinets really quick and the coolers, water and everything like that. Some paper. I'll take it for shotgun crafting. Sounds like. Oh, Mikey, how you doing, buddy? We'll let him go beat on the door. He can, he can be a uh, gentleman. Yeah, just give me a second while I be into all the crates and uh, the safe, and uh, I will uh, show you the loot. One more hit, and we're into the safe. And just some paper. I did find some paper out of that filing cabinet. But let's check the working stuff's boxes. Wood frames, very nice. Ooh, nice, a full nail gun, so got another one of those. In case you're uh you haven't seen earlier episodes, I I lost my uh my nail gun like uh due to a death uh earlier on in the series. I think we'll actually just scrap those frames down. Nice iron pickaxe, which I'll save for uh save for uh um, what do you call it? Merging! That's what it is. Sorry for the darkness here, but Mikey finally broke in while I was breaking down the boxes. Come here, buddy. Come here. Mikey, come on. There you go. Good boy. Uh, checked all these crates. Yep. Get some nice mechanical parts, uh... Which not in really in need of those anymore. Scrap the iron gardening hoe down. Scrap the nails. Some nail gun pieces. Um, throw those out and I can actually assemble those because uh, I've uh, found the nail gun schematic how many times. Um, Mikey, what'd you have for me? Piece of duct tape. I'll drink the beer. Cheers, Mikey. Uh, nothing in there. Try and free up a little bit of storage space. We'll throw in the, um, the receiver to the nail gun. And check this one in. Auger blade, very nice. I can actually make auger blades. I believe I have everything to a, to an auger, uh, except for parts, like, like the gears and everything to it, like a couple claw hammers, we'll just scrap those up for for wherever they got and eh, just drop that let's see what's in the old bathroom uh, gunpowder, yeah I know I could just throw stuff in the uh, in the mini bike, uh, but we'll just scrap that down for iron because I got plenty of food 
Green alcohol blood bags. Our turd. Uh, we'll just leave that stuff there. It's like I don't really plan on coming back for stuff. Uh, it's not going to be moving out here pretty quick. Scrap that down. More iron. I just wanted to raid the uh, working stuffs here for uh, extra extra iron goodness out of the uh, out of the working stiffs boxes because they can give you some pretty decent iron. Like there. Very nice. So, just gonna throw some junk into the old uh, the mini bike here, and let's see. That's already pretty much full up on loot. So, before I uh, run back to base. Let's actually just check out the roof. Uh, oh, I already read it because uh, from the last time I was here. Can't forget those dukes. Just scrap the springs down. We're running low on old uh, loot, uh, loot storage. And sun's setting in a couple hours. Well, since I have a little bit of extra time, uh, I don't... Actually, I don't think I can break into the, uh... Yes, I can. I have that higher pickaxe. Just give me a little bit and I will break into the, uh... Break into this, uh, bunker here. Uh, so, be back in a moment for you. And I've broken into the bunker and the safe. Let's check what we got. Shotgun parts, long barrel, and some hunting rifle stock, so some good pieces out of there. Actually, something useful for once in this wood chest, but Charlie, what you got? Nada. Wouldn't really expect too much out of you, but besides maybe a 40 or magnum piece, but... Pair that leather duster there with the the leather I'm finding. There, it might stop at a trader on the uh, way back to uh, home. Uh, well, actually, I'm going to be traveling overnight, so um, nothing in that, nothing in that. It's just after nine o'clock. Not too much in there. More paper. I'll take it. As long as I got, in, as long as stack's not full, I'm you know, fine taking it. So, toilet, nothing, nothing from you, Charlie. Nothing out of the bathroom, really. What about the cooler? You got anything cooking for me? My steel pickaxe did actually break, so I decided like. You know, with how many pieces of steel I'm gonna have to use to repair it, I'm just gonna... I decided to scrap it. It gave me 300 iron, so... If you have uh, steel tools unlocked in the world and... in your world and you have, uh, and you find, like, like really low-quality ones, uh, you just don't want to uh, repair them at all, just to uh, scrap them. They're really good for... using, uh, you know, really good for... Uh, 300 iron, so just checking out this room here, like this. I guess you call it the storage room. Make a pretty decent, uh, pretty decent storage you know, area for your own base. Like, uh, um, we'll just sc scrap this stuff down. But yeah, nighttime is uh, about to come, so I'd say we've had a pretty good day, uh, turn the headlight on, and, uh, a pretty successful day, a lot of good loot, and, and, uh, I'm gonna leave this episode here, I'm gonna get my stuff, uh, I'm gonna get my stuff organized for, uh, not on nighttime, you know, try to put weapons together, and as much as possible, and, uh, I'll head back to, I'll start heading back to town, if, uh, 
if you see me uh, on the road at the beginning of the next episode, then it means it took a little bit longer than I expected. There's nighttime, so I thank you so much for watching, and hope you like, comment, and subscribe, and uh, and I will see you in the next episode. Take care, everybody.